So let's try it with a normal pencil. This one is, doesn't have that tip anymore. Let's try... Ah, awesome, works like a charm. All right, and we now have another perfectly sharpened pencil. And if you also use color pencils or pencils in your artwork, we all know that these needs to be sharpened frequently so that they would have that pointy tip. And as for me, I'm, I'm very much annoyed that I have to go back and forth to the trash can frequently because just after three or four times of sharpening, barrels like these, or these, in especially smaller ones like these, gets full very easily. And that's also the reason I have um, several sharpeners because I wait until they are all full before I go to the trash can so that I can throw them out all at once. Alright, so now let me show you all of the things that we are going to need to make that sharpener hack. Alright, so let's start with the bottle. So this is just a simple um, juice bottle, so uh, make sure you clean it out first, uh, wash it before you use it. And as for the bottle, you, you may want to get one that has a larger spout or larger opening so that when it gets full with pencil shavings, it's easier to uh, throw it out because it has a large opening. Right. And... Okay, there we go. And next is, um, you're going to need hot glue or a glue gun. Uh, I prefer this type of glue because it, it it's going to hold the sharpener uh, much better than you know the usual uh, school glue or Elmer's. I suggest you use this one. Another thing that you need is something to slice with. So I have a, a pen type cutter here. You see there's the tip right there but you can use a box cutter um, if you don't have something like this one uh, I just prefer using a pen type cutter because it gives me more uh, control over uh, what I'm cutting and also it's it's just that before uh, I used a, uh, a box cutter and it slipped in my hand and it almost cut my finger so I'm not gonna use a, a box cutter anytime soon so I'll just go by the uh, pen type cutter here okay and last but not the least of course you're gonna need a sharpener you can use one like this um, the one that doesn't have a barrel but I just prefer this one because it has two holes here and um, it sharpens two different types of tips one is shorter and one has a, uh, a longer tip. Uh, I use this one for coloring and then the longer tip is more for sketching. And also the reason I, I, I chose this sharpener because the blades are removable. So I'll just give it a push here. That should pop right out. All right, there we go. And this is the one that we will be using for our sharpener hack. I think we got everything that we need here, so let's start. Um, we're gonna start off with a bottle. We need to take out the cap first. I'm gonna set our cap down right here. And let's also go get our sharpener. And we will be tracing the size of the opening to the cap. Okay. We should get roughly the, the exact size of the sharpener. Alright, so this is what I have so far. Next step is for us to make that cut. Pen top cutter here. And I'm gonna start cutting. So, um, just be careful when you do this step. Uh, make sure um, 
careful not to cut yourself. Or you can ask some help. Make sure you're doing this slowly and safely. Alright, so now that we are done, and all I have to do is push it in. Just like that. Right. And now we can take this off. Alright, and you should have a slot on the cap where you, we can just slide this in. Just like that. And perfect. There we go. So now we are going to need to um, secure this because as you can see it's still uh, loose. So we're going to use our hot melt glue or glue gun to secure our sharpener in there. So I have um, our hot melt glue um, heating up here for around five minutes. And let's move over here so that we can uh, secure the sharpener onto the cap, right? So as of this time, this is still very much movable. See? So we need to put a little bit of hot glue there to secure it. All right. Okay. I think we are ready. Okay, let me just flatten that out. Yeah, okay, so I think we are ready. Okay, so you guys, um, since this is hot milk glue, make sure to be careful uh, when you're using this. Because this can cause um, serious burns um, if you're not careful. Uh, you may also want to ask for uh, help um, if you're going to do this. Some here on the outside to uh, seal it up. I'm trying to be careful not to. Uh, put a hot glue onto the center. That's not. That's not gonna be good if, if hot glue gets into the the blade of the sharpener. Yeah. Okay. So I think we are all good here, and uh, we just need to wait for this to completely um, cool down before we use it. Yeah. I think that's it. All good. So I'm just going to give it around um, 10 minutes or so to make sure that it cools down and hardens before we start using it. Okay, so I'm just going to set this here for around 10 minutes and I'll see you in a bit. Alright guys, so uh, now we are back in our station here. And we have the, the, the cap here with the sharpener attached to it, all completely hardened and cooled out. So I think we are ready to, to use it. <laughs> okay, the moment of truth. We got our uh, bottle right here. First things first, is it going to fit? I hope I didn't put too much um, hot glue back there. That's gonna be a problem if it doesn't fit. Ah, okay. That's nice. All right, fits perfectly. You can see that sharpener right there. We now have a bigger barrel for our sharpener. So uh, say goodbye to going frequently to the trash can to. Uh, throw away those shavings. 
All right, so it's going to take a while for this to to be full or get filled out. And that's nice. And again, the moment of truth here. Um, let's sharpen this out. And let's see. Here is our newly sharpened pencil. Perfect. That is awesome. All right, so let me. I want to try another one here. So let's try it with a normal pencil. This one is, doesn't have that tip anymore. Let's try. Ah, awesome. Works like a charm. Alright, and we now have another perfectly sharpened pencil. Okay, and that's it for today's video. And thank you so much for joining me today. And if you also go and uh, try this project out, please do let me know. Um, hashtag uh, my art life, and uh, I want to see what you came up with <laughs> for uh, your your sharpener hack project. All right. So thank you again, guys, for joining me, and uh, I'll see you on our next video. Have a great day, everyone.